this great city has become unrecognizable. Mosul's once bustling neighborhoods now destroyed. Iraqi forces are facing fierce resistance. The fight is becoming harder the further they advance. Crucial to the ground troops is air support, and there have been intense airstrikes. But reports seem to indicate that these were civilian homes. Airstrikes hit two houses, and the third house was hit by a missile. We received information that there are a couple of families under the rubble. We called the civil defense to rush here. Now we are sure there are civilians under the rubble. ISIL is known to use civilians as human shields, but it is not clear what happened here. The area is in total ruins. Our search teams are working in full swing to rescue people and pull out any bodies from under the rubble. It's a big catastrophe. Several airstrikes hit the New Mosul neighborhood. And that's also where these people are fleeing from. Every day, thousands are forced to leave their homes. They're awaiting to be put on buses. Then they will be processed and screened and taken onto camps. Life for now will be in a tent without any of the comforts of home. Nobody wants to make this journey. But the battles here are far too intense. It is now street by street. Close quarters combat, ISIL fighters are often just an alleyway, a house, or just a block away. And snipers are everywhere. The soldiers say despite heavy resistance, they are making advances. But no one here is under any illusion. This war is far from over, and it is likely to get much worse as they advance into the heart of the city. Stephanie Decker, Al Jazeera, Erbil.